Hapa ni ndani ya uwanja wa Azam Complex siku ya Azam Media Day kuzungumza na wachezaji pamoja na benchi la ufundi na kushoto kwangu nipo na Jibril Sila. Sawa? Sawa wewe. Sawa. Sawa sawa. Today's game season. Oui, c'est mon deuxième season. How do you feel? Yeah, I feel good. You feel good? Yeah. Uh, you didn't start well the league this season. Uh, we have seen the farewell from the coach Dabo and you didn't make it for the calf qualification. Uh, we would like to know how much pressure you had uh, playing the calf Champions League against APR. Yeah, yeah, it was uh, we didn't start the league good. We wanted to qualify and then it didn't happen. We were having too much pressure to qualify, you know. At the end it didn't happen, so it's football. So do you think it's one among the reasons that led you starting the league with poor performance and poor results. Yeah, definitely because all the players wanted to qualify, and after we don't qualify, so mentally we are not better. So we are going through a lot of things. So, but now we forget this and start a new page, try to win something in the league. Yeah. You have the new coach now. I think this is the first to fifth game. Uh, we would like to know uh, how do you catch up with the new coach, his training facilities, position and everything inside the pitch. Yeah, it's good, it's good. We're trying to adapt, you know. So now we have more time. Maybe we train with him two, two, one month, I think. It's good. And now we trying to understand all his tactics, the way he wants us to play. Now we understand, so we're enjoying it. Do you enjoy mostly playing against Yang or Simba on your side as a player? For me, I enjoy every game. <laughs> every game? Every game. But you shine mostly when you play against Yang. <laughs> and I, I hope you, you sometimes have some time to to walk around the social medias and you can see, like, I remember the, the game that you won to need to warn. Yeah. Uh, that was the game Gibri Silla was spoken to everybody around the social medias. Yeah, yeah. Maybe, you know, sometimes... It's not like uh, when you play big teams, it's normal. You have to play because it's a derby game. So every derby, everybody is ready, you know. So that's why. Do you think there are some few preparations despite other games when you play against Young or Simba? No, it's the same. It's the same? It's the same preparation. But maybe when you play in, a, in like big teams like Young or Simba, they have good players. So maybe... You see us uh, run a lot because it's normal. Yes. When you play younger Simba, it's normal. You have to run because they have good players. Even the players like small team, you control the game. You have the ball always. So, but the fun says that when you play against younger or Simba, we see the Gibraltar differently from the other teams that you play against. Ah, maybe it's, maybe they see it like that, you know. Yes. <laughs> How do you see your life in Azam FC? Yeah, it's going good. It's good. So I'm just gonna enjoy the moment here. Sometimes we're hearing that like, Gibraltar needs to sign to Young or Simba. Are these rumors reaching to you? And so far, so good. When someone asks you about Simba and Young on your side, do you see like there are teams that if you have a chance to participate as a player, you can have that opportunity? No, I don't want to, I don't want to answer that question because if I do, I don't want to. Because I don't want to answer that question. And so far, the league, you lost one match, certain draws and winnings. And do you see that the Arsenal FC, which had good performance last season, can stand up now and having good qualities as we saw last season? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can fight for... We're still fighting for the league because it's not finished yet. We're still fighting for the league. And what about the CAF Champions League? Yeah, we want... The ticket to... is very difficult to have it. To qualify for the calf? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to qualify for the calf. Yeah, so. Okay. Jubusila, tell us, um, in this Tanzanian Premier League, who is the challengiest player? I mean, for the fullbacks, right and left, and the centre back, when you first? The challengiest player? Yeah. That if you first him after the match, you say, ah, today I really first the, a challengiest player that he gave me a hard time to reach the goal, shoot, assist, even to score. Maybe Baka. Baka. Mm. How can you explain about Baka? He's very tough. Tough, tough guy, good player. Good player. Baka, yeah. 
It's tough. <laughs> Have you ever met Baka and spoke about him? Uh, how good it is, it is facing him, especially when you play at Benjamin Mkapa? No, no, we just shake hands, but we never spoke. You never spoke? No, no, no. But you admit Baka is a good player? Yeah, he's a very good player. Okay, tell us, um, since you joined Azam FC, do you have this chance to participate for the national team? How Azam helps you to enlarge your performance, your position, so as you can have a chance to participate for the national team? Yeah, for my country, it's difficult when you play in Africa. You have to play in Europe, so they won't call you. If you play Africa, they will not call you. You have to play in Europe, top leagues, you know, in Gambia, because you have so many players playing in Europe, so... Their mentality is like that, you know. It's different from other countries. But why Azam FC? We've uh, heard a new Zealand. We've heard a lot of things. We've heard a lot of things. Maybe we're not going to sign with Azam. We'll see. This season is your last season. Yes, it's my last season. But tout c'est possible. Tout c'est possible. Yeah. Okay. Si Az, uh, Yanga vient, Simba vient, you can speak. <laughs> let's tombe. <laughs> okay. oh, tomber. Oui, laisse tomber. Okay, uh, let's finish with this one. This season, do you think you can make it for the leader of assists or goals? Yeah, I'm sure because he's still young. Uh -huh. Yeah. Who is the craziest, craziest player and the comedy one in this club? In Azam? Yes, in Azam. Sebo. Sebo. He's very crazy. <laughs> Why Sebo? Because he's crazy, always insulting. <laughs> Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Bwana huyo ni Jibril Sila na hayo ni machache kutoka kwake. Asante sana. Brown Media. Brown Media. Hapa ni nyumbani.